The Japanese company Aeronext has unveiled its next-generation prototype called the Flying Gondola, a hybrid electric vertical takeoff and landing vehicle. Designed for safe and comfortable travel, the Flying Gondola stands out from other air transport concepts with its unique design and control approach. The main idea behind the Flying Gondola is to create a convenient air transport vehicle that provides a smooth and stable flight. It is equipped with 4D gravity technology, which controls the center of gravity, minimizing vibrations and ensuring passenger comfort. The design features inclined wings with eight adjustable propellers to optimize flight. The first prototype of the Flying Gondola is intended for a single passenger, but future models are planned to accommodate multiple passengers. The Flying Hammock Drone is an innovative concept that involves using drones to suspend a hammock in the air without the need for trees or other supports. This unconventional approach to outdoor relaxation was developed as an experiment and marketing stunt, showcasing the potential of drones in unique applications. Despite the appeal of the idea, it faces several technical challenges. Most current drones are not capable of supporting the weight of a person, and their operation is accompanied by significant noise, which could make relaxation difficult. The idea of a flying hammock was featured in a marketing campaign by the insurance company Central Bahir, which illustrated how technology can transform traditional notions of comfort and leisure. Hoversurf Company recently demonstrated a new technological achievement, a concept for a flying car utilizing Venturi EDF, or electric ducted fans technology. This project represents a separation from traditional drones with propellers, focusing instead on a more streamlined enclosed design aimed at enhancing safety and reducing noise. The first test flight of a scale model using Venturi EDF technology was successful, showcasing the potential of this new propulsion system. The Venturi EDF design aims to improve control, stability, and efficiency compared to conventional propellers. By placing the fans inside ducts, the system reduces the risk of accidents and creates a more aerodynamic structure. The XXL Copter, developed by Andreas Johnson, is a large custom-built drone designed to carry a human. This drone is equipped with a powerful propulsion system, including an outrunner brushless motor, and is stabilized by the DJI Wukong M flight controller. The Wukong M is known for providing advanced flight stabilization, which is crucial when carrying heavy loads such as a person. Janssen's XXL Copter has demonstrated its ability to safely lift and transport a human, making it one of the notable examples of manned drone technology. Videos on Janssen's channel show the drone in action, highlighting its flight capabilities and the precision of the Wukong M stabilizer, which allows for smooth and controlled flight even with the additional weight of a passenger. Introducing one of the most unusual drones developed by the Finnish company Misty Friday Films, known as the Killer Drone. This drone is unique because it is equipped with a real chainsaw. The Killer Drone gained fame through a viral video showcasing its capabilities, such as destroying snowmen, cutting tree branches and other objects. It is built on the DJI S1000 Octocopter platform, which has been modified to carry the heavy chainsaw. The drone's design underwent significant changes, including the reconfiguration of the fuel system and the installation of a servo motor to control the chainsaw's carburetor. One of the killer drone's key features is its ability to perform complex tasks, such as trimming and removing trees and branches in hard-to-reach places. However, the killer drone does have its limitations. Its flight time is only about five minutes due to the heavy weight of the chainsaw and the high instability of the structure. Introducing the DJI Agris T30, one of the most advanced agricultural drones in the world. The DJI Agris T30 can take off with a 30-liter payload of solution and cover an area of up to 16 hectares in one hour. Its intelligent system is powered by AI algorithms and automatically adjusts the balance between the remaining fuel and battery level, devising an optimal plan for recharging and refueling. This approach ensures faster and more efficient application of necessary solutions, optimizing both costs and time. 
the Agris T-30 can ascend to a maximum height of 30 meters and reach a top flight speed of 10 meters per second, with a processing speed of up to 7 meters per second, making it highly effective for covering large areas. Engineers from the Japanese company ProDrone have introduced a fascinating drone model, the PD-6BAW Arm, equipped with specially designed robotic arms for performing hands-on operations. The drone's capabilities are truly impressive. Using its claws, the drone can deliver water and flotation devices, as well as confidently carry away a metal chair. It can also perch on a railing like a bird of prey. However, ProDrone has not provided specific details on how the model would handle eagles, which security experts consider natural enemies of drones. While the drone's arms can carry approximately 10 kilograms, its maximum payload capacity is 20 kilograms. It can fly for up to 30 minutes at speeds of up to 60 kilometers per hour on a single charge. According to its manufacturers, the drone can perform various operations at great heights, over long distances, and in places that would be too dangerous for humans, including cargo retrieval, cable cutting, turning handles, flipping switches, dropping rescue buoys and extracting hazardous materials. At the National Aviation Conference in Berlin, Volocopter and DB Schenker unveiled their latest cargo drone capable of carrying up to 200 kilograms. The companies collaborated to develop solutions for fast and eco-friendly cargo transport, resulting in a UAV that stands 2.15 meters tall, has a diameter of 9.15 meters, and a total takeoff weight of 600 kilograms. This fully electric drone can transport a 200 kilogram payload over a distance of approximately 40 kilometers. It is capable of autonomous flights beyond the line of sight, with vertical takeoff and landing capabilities. In the future, the Volo drone could be used for transporting goods to hard-to-reach areas, such as mountainous regions or disaster-stricken zones, as well as for intra-city cargo delivery. Write in the comments which of the drones in today's video you liked the most. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Caro Show channel. Also check out our previous videos. Goodbye.